By the time you're seeing this video, there is one week left of the Wii U and 3DS servers being online. And for someone that plays Splatoon all the time, this is... it is heartbreaking. This game, it, it, it's like a staple of my life, because I've been playing it for seven years. And when I was a kid and I saw this game, I was hooked on it. I played in 2017 because uh, the previous owner of the Wii U, they didn't, they didn't want it because the Switch came out. And we got the Wii U and it was, it, it, I, I still think to this day that the Wii U is better than the Switch just because it's, it, it was like, it was my childhood, it was like a big part of that, and I'd play on this all the time. It, it was, it was unique, it was new, you play with eight people, it, it was like, it was a new world, and I've met so many people through Splatoon, and my good friend Refill I've met, and we've, we've had so much fun playing. Splatoon and Splatoon 1. Now, I'm not I'm not trying to cause like any panic, but rather just enjoy what you have before it's too late because you you won't regret it. Um it's it's just it's eye-opening cuz it's it's the realization I'm not going to be able to play this anymore. But there's Pretendo and stuff, but you have to mod your Wii U with a computer, and it's already hard to get into Splatoon lobbies, but to mod it on top of that, it's basically going to do nothing. So, if you have a Wii U, or 3DS, just play your childhood, and just relive what you can, because it's, it's going, and it's, it's hard, but... I understand, because a lot of people have moved on, and I'm, I'm going to have to move on from this as well, and it's, it's, it's kind of emotional.